guys welcome back to my channel my name is Nidhi and in today's video we are going to see how to style a sari or wear a sari in different ways so I've tried so many ways and it's like modern semi-classic and traditional wear so if you're bored of wearing the sari in the same style please do watch this video it's only made for y'all I'm going to show you different ways in how you're going to wear your sari so now a big announcement is the shout out winner for today is Varshini thank you Varshini thank you so much for being a part of my family and subscribing to my channel thank you so much and what you have to do to take part in the shout out is like this video subscribe to my channel and also comment down below as to how you like the video and also tag me in your instagram story to get a big shout out so without any further ado let's begin so now for the first style we need a sari and pins these are only the two things which you'll need for doing these styles so first style what we are going to do is open the sari completely and what we are going to do is keep the pallu on the right hand side so that how you tie a sari that is how you are going to do and keep the pallu length little more than the other left hand side one and now catch a point where you can tie it now we are going to tie it around the waist to secure it and keep it very tight and sturdy I am tying two knots and tucking in the extras now in the left leg put the cloth back and start pleating it behind your leg and then we're going to start pleating it it should be thin pleats so it'll be very nice and what you're going to do is take that extras and tuck it in inside to form a nice long pleat look and now we're repeating the process for the same right leg we pass it under the leg and then take the pallu and start by pleating it thin pleats are more better and now we catch all the pleats together form it a nice thin one and now what we're going to do is put it over the shoulder and you can see and then you can adjust according to your length and how you want it to be and the borders to come out now using a pin you can secure this so that it doesn't come out and cause any discomfort so nicely secure it if you want you can use two to three pins now you can see i've worn a blouse and looks really amazing so traditional and so nice for any party you can go like this any traditional one and now i've just added on some accessories to look more gorgeous and you can just see the final look and you can take click pictures which will look amazing now let's move on to the second style so again the same sari i'm using because of one sari different styles and now what we're going to do is take the two ends of the sari and we are going to tie a knot tie two knots so that it's secure one in the starting of the sari and one near the pallu so take the pallu and tie the knot again to form a sleeve this is to form a sleeve and look very nice like a butterfly sleeve so again we're going to tie two knots and secure it and now put the sari behind and what we're going to do is nicely partition it by taking the correct side. So fully open the sari again and make it proper so that it is giving an amazing look. And now we got hold of the two shoulders and we're putting it in through the hole there. You're going to pass through your hand and now take the back extras and start by pleating it. Pleat it again thin and nice and you'll get a really thick pleat because there's a lot of sari behind. We're going to pleat the entire sari and you can see how thick it's going to form and now what we are going to do is take a pin and secure this so that even if it falls you can just take and tuck in and there's no other issue so after securing with the pin tightly take it and tuck it in your pant so before doing this make sure to wear a nice tight pant which will hold the tucks in and now we are going to tuck it in really well so that it doesn't come out tuck it according to the length and now start separating your leg and pull the butterfly sleeves and take the center point which comes under and start by tucking it in your pant slowly take and tuck in according to the desired form you want your pant to look and make the border to be seen little so that it look really nice and this is how you're going to tuck it and then adjust it according to your wish and now what i'm going to do is tuck it so that it's tight enough and pull the borders out now I'm repeating the same process for the left one. Same thing, just tuck it in gently and then pull out and you want nice pleats to be formed and you can see an amazing look is created. Now what you're going to do is turn back and crisscross the sleeves, catch the sleeves and try to crisscross it. And then what you're going to do is remove the, both the sleeves and catch the crisscross tightly and take a pin and secure it so that it forms a nice crisscross at the back and look really pretty so that the full back will be covered and you can wear any small or crop top which will look really great. And now we're, what we're going to do 
is where both the sleeves in and then we are going to repeat the same process for the front side also so we are going to accumulate all the thing uh, all the pleats and then start by securing it with a pin so i'm using a pin and securing it you can do how much deep you want and now what we're going to do is to give a defined and nice look to look thin or to look better we are going to take a belt or a jewelry this is the jewelry which you use for a waist and use it to give a nice defined look and also secure it with a pin so that there is double security and you look gorgeous and you can see such an amazing look is created with one sari which was boring but looking amazing now thank you guys thank you so much for watching my video if you like my video don't forget to hit that like button subscribe to my channel and don't forget to click on the notification bell and click all and do share it with your friends so that even they get to know how to style your sari in different ways and you can do a lot of poses in instagram facebook or anything you can shoot any photo and you look gorgeous so thank you so much and let's see in the next video bye